Picking up my controller here. Hey there, everyone. This is Hellcow playing ASMT, and this is it. It's King Charles Castle. It's right here. I'm not gonna do the whole thing today. <laughs> this level is huge and weirdly organized. Like, I don't even know if I want to do a cleanup. Like, I did a cleanup back in the day, right? Like, what's the experience of just playing this level? I don't know. I don't really know what to expect ish. But here we are, we got four doors, I forgot which is where, which is where, how, why, but, um... I do remember that this is a pretty good start. That, like, one door actually leads to this, uh, like, marathon. Like, one door is actually, like, three or four sections. And then there's two hallways, like, it is kind of a nightmare. I'm just gonna basically feel my way, like, I'm gonna start with this here, if I don't feel it, I might just change. Look around so you... Like, I wanna bounce on it, but... You, 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 if you wanna bounce on it, you have to decide to do that pretty early on. I think this is the path I had chosen back in the day. Like, I think this is one of the rooms I played a few times. It's been a bit. Uh-oh, I'm... Oh, jeez. Well, I mean... You just gotta divine that a spin jump is what you want there, I guess. Tile set here. I think it's custom for this castle. Huh. Get out of here. Whoa, skeleton. Well, it used to be. And now you're just calcium. There we go. Yeah, these pipes are an illusion, but it doesn't really factor in all that much. Trail a coin. I don't know why it's doing that shape. Go, thank you for passing by. There's the sun on the ground. Whoa. These blocks been useful. Alright, if you say so, get a one up, and then you get a free passage here. Alright, see? But see, that's just one. There's more that's coming forward now. It's more dark, but also you Oh, this is a Yoshi Cookie Zeus. Hey, let's deprogram the ghost. Here, the timing doesn't really fit all that well. Okay, now it does. Whoosh. Alright. Then you get weird layer nonsense. Like, this is, like, technologically advanced. We've got hyper lasers here. Here we go. Excited to bounce. Who wouldn't be? I just killed myself. Why did I duck? I thought I would, like, keep sliding duck-wise, but instead, Demo stopped in her track rather than maintain momentum. I guess you want to jump up into the platform. But the truth is, like, maybe the other rooms are, like, way easier. I, I doubt that. <laughs> I extremely doubt that. See, I'm seeing these and I wonder, is there a way to jump to get to bop that feather? And the answer is just no. Like, it's way too shallow a jump. It'd be impossible. Now, I don't know why I was being cagey about doing cleanup. I think I definitely want to do a cleanup. Just, you know, I'll do that after I beat the level. It'll be part of the post-game experience. This part, I'm not a fan of. You just kind of have to wait for everything to get together. See, the thing is, though, this place, strictly speaking, easier if you're small. But, you know, if I'm small, I'm small. See... Yeah, the big mistake I did is that you want to jump up there so that you got plenty of time here. There you go. Now, you're approaching like, yeah, the Tetris room. I remember this. This is very memorable. You got all these funny little Tetris ghosts. They're saying hello and there is the Tetris boo. I think you can't jump on him. He's just there to take up room. He throws lasers of his own. I'm touching ghost all day long. If I had done a very shallow spin jump, I would have been fine. I would have been super fine. So fine, I would have lost my goat. And fell. Uh, get an extra beat here, though. But, I mean, having one more would be good. Hey, this is really neat. I don't like this Magic Koopa. I don't feel like he adds much to what's going on. 
and like the fact that like it just takes up space. Like just let me run the Tetris Gauntlet, man. It's fine. It's totally okay. Well, I got her there. Hey, but we're past, and we get to eat food that will never last. Uh, how do you do this? Like that, but better? Not happening. Also, this is- Oh, why'd you keep advancing that much? Demo! Bound to happen eventually. Alright, just for a slight change of pace, I don't know, let's try just another room, just to, to compare. Cause like, at, th at first I thought this was gonna be fine, but now I feel like the ghost room is like, three screens too long. Let's just try another, like, one, just to see, just to compare, just compare experiences. Naturally, going through here, I won't have unlimited lives, but then again, like, I, I, I stopped getting unlimited lives as soon as I died before the 1-up, so... It's not a true unlimited. Partial unlimited. So, here you got this that feels uncomfortable. Then we're down here, everything is blue to remind me of veal. Real bad veal, still blue. I guess that's just... I think that's a way that's like... Blue is like very uncooked or something. Am I making that up? Whoa. So, this place is. Ah, dude! Betrayed by the bread. Also, like that door is just. I don't want to enter that door. So, nope. Disqualified. Not taking this path. Just because of that door at the end. Nope, it, it matters. Like, it's something I might have to redo 10, 15 times. I'm going to be selective. <laughs> so, far door. Anything interesting here? Well, interesting, probably. Oh, so here you start with a cape. So immediately... I wonder if this is the path I took, actually, to beat the level now. Like, j the, just the psychology of giving me a cape right now is meaningful. That cannon on fire. But maybe it's because I was just hanging out too close. Two capes? Like, what is going on here? That counts as being enough to hurt me. Alright. Here you go, Charlie. You get to lose your neck while those, these guys run in the air. Another one of these. Yeah, we got fish. Like, this is not the shortest level in the world, but... Yeah, honestly, it is kind of long. Ah, dude. It is kind of long. Like, if I compare- Ah, oh, it's just- Yeah, like, I don't know. I- They all feel a bit too long. Like, there's supposed to be rooms in the Bowser Fortress type experience. Not- You're not making a whole fortress here. I mean, I kind of like it because of the cape, but I don't like it because it feels a bit long, and then you get a whole bunch of generator nonsense. Again, it's a level you need to do several times. Here we get these completely redrawn Koopas. Also, Koopas. Uh, we seem to have found a, a portal to this guy's face. Another stupid wizard. I don't remember these graphic swaps at all. Is he sitting on my- uh, dude, get out of here. Yeah, here's Bone Zone, and here's, oh, well, this is an unfortunate meme to see in 2021. Oh, shoot, yeah, okay. Yeah, uh, this is dangerous, I don't, yeesh. And then here, you just kind of bounce, and you end up here. Alright, it's not that bad! I don't know, I'm trying to think. It's not that bad, but you don't get a 1-up. Here, I remember this one also being okay. I guess we'll find out. Here we go. Then you get Charlie here. Somehow that counts as me getting hurt? Why not? Why not? Alright. Yeah, if it weren't for... Like, I, I understand why the ghostly wizard is here. It's an impressive little demonstration of silly tech. But boy, does it not improve the experience of playing this level. Like... 
is just so in a way. Like, I feel like this level really wants you to just kind of go. Something I feel you're discouraged from doing. Is he gonna despawn? Wait, last time he despawned somehow. Okay, well now the top ghost here despawned, so... Uh, made that a lot easier. Alright, you don't get a new hit here, but the fact that I do have a hit is useful. It's very easy to just, like, touch the ghosts. Ah, oh, shoot. Dude, what the hell, man? It's very easy to touch the ghost when they're technically like still surfacing slightly like just you can't see them but they, like I I am yeah that's that's real unfortunate no yeah this one is super quick Ugh, and the, the wizard didn't kill me there my issue is here it's gonna be a guy it's a kicking kind of mood And I have to do something about it. Ah, crud. Well, okay. Now, things are a bit different. I can do that. I saw that thrill that bat. <sighs> Charlie's everywhere. Charlie is everywhere. I don't want to die if I can help it. Yeah, you get down there. Alright, so... Here you do have to get up here. Ugh, there might be a car up in here. I don't know. Like, I have no timer, so let's use that. Let's use that to our advantage. How about that? This is not fun. No having fun here. Alright, so. Do I have time to cross this spiky tunnel? Probably not. That was foolish on my end. I don't know why I made this decision. All I know is that I did. And I regret it. That fish has been taken to heaven. Lucky fish. Alright, that's weird. Everything here is weird. I think I'm safe here. I just kind of jumped up there without thinking. So we're gonna find a P-switch that's gonna let us get that one shell? Why don't I just use the P-switch to knock the blocks down? How about that? Oh, we can get one up here, though. That's fun. Yeah. Like, yeah. You don't... Probably an oversight. You know what? I respect that. Oversights happen. I think I'm gonna be safe here. Like, this clearly exists to exist. I love existing. It's my number one frontier highway zone cloud. Oh, huh, glad to hear it. Oh, there's a ceiling, by the way. Alright, there's a roof above my head you do not know. Huh? Yeah, I pressed the P switch. I did it. Alright. Three rooms deep. Oh, this is a new, th this is a Tails room. It says ASMT. Oh, I don't know. Like, isn't this one, like, really long, though? And kind of complicated? Like, your goal is you get something to jump up there, maybe? Alright, well, here I am. Animation, can't deal with it. Monster party, out of the magma. God, trails of lard everywhere reminding us of what it is to be alive. You can run up the thing if you want, then you can run the thing if you want. Lava and stuff, shapes and stuff. Yeah, I like the word stuff. What about it? Stuff crouton, two ninety nine. I messed it up, but by doing that. Your magic spell fell through the land. All these super inconvenient jumps. There we go. Ah, hey, looking forward to doing it backwards. Because we... Oh, hi, plant, frog. So I might want to hit that switch at some point. I don't really know. Check it out. Things are happening, I guess, maybe. Lava for you and me. I'm going to fry you up and remember about Wednesday. That's right, I'll do such a thing in order to conquer the world and everything. There's a door there, but it's a reset door. Yeah, like this is not a room. This is a full-on level. 
that you play after two significantly smaller rooms. Yeah. Alright, yeah, okay, you're here. Not anymore. Uh -huh. uh, I'm just gonna bounce on you here, don't mind me. Hey, baseball, huh? Yeah, that's a sport that exists. Did you know that? Did you know that baseball exists? It's true, it wasn't made up by, like, some frat boys or whatever. It's an actual thing that people invest, like, billions of dollars into it. It's crazy. Anyway, that's a baby Yoshi. Significantly... Okay, what does that arrow mean? That arrow means, hope you don't have fireball, because you've got to get up here. Alright. Uh, alright, that's a block. Oh, here we go. I found a friendly little smiling block. Smiling with its eyes, but it's still smiling. Now we do these awkward jumps all day long. Hey, bye. Uh-huh. There's another block? Do I need both? I mean, I can carry both. It's not a problem. That is part of my skill set. But that still seems odd to just kind of put out there. Alright, Charlie, you get a fall. Well, there's young she here. Gets to dance. Then here, kind of blind hop. Okay, but, I mean, I ended up being safe, so it's all good. Maybe. I don't know anything about anything at all, other than I don't know anything at all. Wow, that is like the worst Charlie in the universe. Like, how do you do that if you don't have Fireball with you? I have a question. Alright, so that's why there's that ledge up there. It's because you're gonna... This is kind of the worst? A little bit of the worst. You understand what's going on, though. Alright, uh, and yeah, like, I pressed the switch to reverse the triangles. Alright, alright, we good? No, but we'll do it. Okay. Uh, I hate everything. Oh, this, this is not working. Alright, um, we can make the platform a turn at the very least. Well, then I got hurt here. Like, this is seriously... Like, I am I beat... I beat the stage, but... You know, you're just being really demanding. Like, why? Why you gotta do it twice? I don't get this. Alright, then you fall here, and then yeah... Eyes were open. And... Ugh, I... Okay. Alright then. Never play this door ever again. Got it. Well, that... That was magnificent. Dude, duh, man! No! Alright, so last time I just got pushed, so just do that. The disqualifier is this. It's very hard to enter doors in Mario. I don't remember this all that much, but it starts with a mushroom, so that went away. Oh, what? Wait, no, wait, what's... What's solid, what isn't? I cannot tell. Okay, here you can see that what is squared is go through. Alright, that's your hint. Wait, is that the floor you start in is also squared? It's just that it has that like outer texture to it? Oh boy. Yeah, I got her there. Um, I don't, this cannot be the easiest option, right? I don't know is a thing. Okay, well, uh, let's observe the world around us. So what kind of, okay, you do lower. It just makes me want to skip your whole existence, though. No offense. I don't know what I'm seeing here. Here you go. That worked out. Uh-uh. Two mushrooms for the price of two mushrooms, really. No rebates here. Just hopping frogs made of gold. Somehow my spin there didn't stick. Like, it didn't feel like a double sprite glitch. It just felt like you went through, like it didn't exist. Oh, that's... I mean, ugh! 
Like these are. Oh, whoa! Why? Why? The 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 the, the timing didn't. Like, this is pretty hard, but it's standard castle hard that I can deal around. What? You went... That's fun. So the radish will just... Oh, man, I thought it was predictable. Like, I don't know how to do this part without getting hurt. Like that. Uh, uh, Alright. <laughs> All right, that's fine. Yeah, this is a little bit scary. Not as scary as my beats just not being. My radishes just refuse to be eaten. There we go. I mean, honestly, it doesn't matter that much. A little bit it matters enough. There we go. Yeah, so many sprites that things feel kind of wobbly in terms of control. You would expect that. There you go. Yay! All right. Uh, oh, hey! Look at that. All right. Just a big old room of happy, vaguely harp-shaped men. There we go. Jump through the world and welcome one and two the end. So now we're at room three. Standard length. I don't remember this at all. Whoa. Alright. Go. Uh. That's what I thought. Now we add a wizard to the misc. Misc. To the miscellaneous. Alright, this just keeps on being mushrooms. It cannot ever be more than a mushroom. Are you kidding me? I thought I saw a Potobo, but like. They only pop, like, once each. Is there... Oh, well, that's... Very rude. Uh, is it worth the risk? It sure is. Ah, especially if it turns out you can just do that. Oh, totally worth the risk. Super worth the risk. So much whisk worth thing that I'm gonna forget how to speak in English. Alright, I don't know why I'm carrying this P-Switch with me, honestly. <laughs> I just am. Alright, well, because you need to P-Switch here. It says P right here. You're supposed to grab this and use it somewhere. Like, here? I, I guess you can make yourself a bridge here, then you're like, ah. Then you're here. I thought I saw an object fall. But then nothing did. You're supposed to A. You're supposed to fly. What? What if you don't have wing? You're supposed to... What? I feel like things kind of broke apart near the end there. But that's as furthest I got, so I guess I'll keep going this way. I shouldn't have pressed the P-Switch, where the game clearly says to press the P-Switch. And I guess? So I can keep using that A as a bridge? Like, what are you trying to tell me? Da -da -da -da. Go. And you kind of vaguely jump over a wave, but then mess up this time. It's a new thing I'm trying, messing up. I I I don't think that beat is worth it, honestly. But yeah, this is a little bit scary, but just use the wizard guy and get the power up there, and then you get a cape. Like it's fine needs to appear where I can bop him. Give me extra height. There you go. And as a bonus, he's just kind of gone for a little bit. Alright, so, mysterious P-switch that don't make sense nor feel good. How's it going? Yeah. Here we go, here we go. The equivalent of a drive on driving a car. Pretty silly. Ask me. Uh, okay. I, I could get hurt. There we go. Thank you, Shell. So, you need to keep your cape on, too, because there's a place where it says fly, like, written clearly in coin. So, like, I don't know if this is meant to be, like, a tool you use to 
shelter your head, but it just does not work that way. Like, the way this works is you go here, you make yourself a little bridge, and you just go. Like, is that supposed to be what happens? I have no idea. And here we go! We're just thrown in. Alright, well, <laughs> you did three. Continue playing. Oh. Uh, Alright, this is like a puzzle of some kind. Like a pipe maze of some kind. I don't know. Can you go up there? No. Like, there's the little corners, right? In Shovel Knight, that means you can go up there. Not in this game. Not now, not today. So yeah, this is... A pipe maze... To get the blue switch. I'm just gonna go in the things. I think it is meaningful that you can return back like that. Alright, maybe like there, okay, so it's just the path you take, is the path you take, scooby-doo, here we go, green hill zone, now you're here, you're like, whoa, where's here, uh, hey, I found it, it was on top of the wall, I knew it, I knew it was on top of the wall, chicanery, well, like, I didn't know, no, but, you could tell that it was somewhere in my display case. I am for the food and I go in the pipe. Now I'm somewhere I don't want to be. You're gonna fire and you're gonna swimple. Or at least swample. Oh, I need another P switch. Well, I'm gonna go in this. Ha! <sighs> Funny! I mean. It would be excruciatingly easy to just clone this P-Switch, so I guess that's what I'm gonna do? I don't know if that's the intention, but it's what I'm gonna do. Like, this is a game meant for me. I am the target audience. At this point in time, I was well-versed with P-Switch cloning and whatnot, so... No, it's not, like that unusual. It's not completely impossible to imagine. Hey. I feel like this is the path I want to take because because it like it's this big weird like to do about puzzles. It's not that hard to just do. Oh, but I remember this room being hard to survive. Okay, they're not fireproof. Oh, look at that! The ghost is like a skeleton. It's, it's the ghost of these guys. I don't know why his ghost was explosive. If your ghost is explosive, I I'm sorry. Like, that's really unfortunate. But people will have fun stories about your funeral, at least. Is the ghost at the funeral? I don't know if that's, like, beyond a time where the ghost would be anywhere close. But, like, honestly, I, I just don't really know. Uh, yeah, you're gonna blow up, man. I know that, because that's, you're different, you know, you're made different, because you're a different brand. Uh, oh, wow, homing bullet. Yeah, that's necessary. Very happy that you're here, friend. Oh, that guy exploded, and I just kind of stood there. Video game are my passion. Explode, please. Whoa, you can see that it was clearly a bomb on. Alright, these wall panels are there because, yeah, these missiles are gonna fly right into them and blow up. You don't just put wall panels there for fun, but you can jump on them and everything is fine. I just jump right in that explosion like a complete idiot. And then I jump right in that ghost like a complete idiot. And... Yeah. Totally worth it. Totally want a feather. Way more than a fireball. Because, like, yeah, with a fireball, you can burn a bro. That's cool. But with a thwack attack, you can thwack a bro. But then you can thwack a bomb, and you can thwack a bullet. And, uh, you know, it's just. I just feel like it's a lot more what I'm actually interested in dealing with in terms of enemy power here. Maybe I'm wrong. I often am. But not this time, I don't think. 
see, because there's a homing guy right here. He's gray. And that's how you know he's homing guy. Uh, and I play bad. That's how you know it's Hao Cow playing. Alright, um... Well, my thwacker, I appreciated it while it was here. What it's worth. Missiles blowing up a ghost. The military is now ready to fend off against the forces of Mario Andretti. No, famous Ghost Lord. If you don't know about him, please revise your history books. Jeez, like, how do you live with yourself? Explosions! Uh, something! Yeah, something. That's my favorite kind of lasagna. Alright, yeah, okay, here we go. Yeah! It's just like pure reflex. Oh, and there's three rooms, though. Oh, I don't like this. And... lost. Alright, so... I might just die here, because this is nonsense. That feels super bad, and there's... yeah? Oh... Oh... Like, six room in a row is a lot. Like, I understand there was a lot of enthusiasms from a lot of fans that wanted to make a room, but... Maybe not make it, so you have to do six rooms in a row? A little bit of a... A little bit of a hint from the future. That was real dumb. Yeah, this level was not balanced around the fact that you might have a cape, and I don't mind exploiting that at all. Because then comes this part. Yeah. I mean, I got a hit this time. That might be a game changer. I don't know. Alright, so what was it? Yeah, this, this clearly... Okay, so... You can kind of use the shape of the obstacle that's coming. Kind of tell where you want to be. Servant. Uh, okay, just be invincible there, but now be super invincible instead. Yeah, that didn't make a whole lot of sense, did it? Alright, now everyone runs to their doom. Just jump straight up and go and enter the moon. Ugh! <laughs> okay, that wasn't that bad. That wasn't that bad, considering... But I feel that I got lucky, and I feel like it's still too much, though. It's six in a row! Like, psychologically, that is so much! But I still think I will do a, a, a cleanup, but it's gonna be after we're done with the castle proper. Before we go into the post game. I think that's the way to go. I mean, anyways, I'm kinda stuck here. Like, I have to continue, but I'm not continuing. Like, next time! It might be the normal game. I prob probably, probably, maybe. There's a lot. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff made for this level.